Hello, Victory family. This is Robin Moore, super proud director of the Glam Unit who just finished their first 300,000 Circle of Achievement. And guess what? Highest increase. Woo! I'm super proud of our Glam Unit. And I just want you guys to know that this is such a blessing. And I want you to know what our Glam Unit stands for because we are blessed by God's love and mercy. And I want to tell you, this has been a year of growth. So, growth in lots of areas but this award is called the highest increase and when i hear that it also means most improved and sometimes if you're an athlete or you're something i think about the people that are most improved were not very good and then they became better they became the best for themselves it's not about beating someone else it's not about beating a record it's about beating your best and for me, I think that's the most important, especially in our Mary Kay businesses in our lives. This is about change and about growth. And if I could say one word that really speaks of my glam unit, it's the growth. The growth in their personal development, the growth in their spiritual development, and the growth of their businesses. And that's what got us here today is growth. And I am super proud of them. And I'm proud of all my girlfriend sales directors that were running this with me. I have to give a shout out to my girl, Nicole Mariakis. This was all her and I running together that competition but guess what we're the biggest supporters of each other as well just cheering each other on so I'm so proud of the be about it unit way to go ladies love you huge and I just want to say that I wish I could tell you the stories of every single glam unit girl what she's overcome what she's done to get where she's at and I just want to share two really really stellar unit members who also were in the top 10 of our Cindy Williams entire national area and number one is Vicki Miner, who actually is in the top three. And by the way, shout out to all the top three Tucson girls. Way to go. Super proud of you guys. But Vicki has been through so much adversity this year. If I could tell you everything she's been through, back surgery, work issues, COVID-19, the things that she struggled through, she has always overcame and finished national quarter sales early this year and put herself in the top three. Next, we have in the top 10, Ashlyn Thies, who has been in Mary Kay for about a year and a half. And when she came in here, she said, this is a company I wanna be a part of and I wanna do big things. So right now, she is a DIQ that will debut August 1st as a brand new sales director. She is a mama of two under two. She runs um, a, practically a farm uh, in Arizona. And she's a full-time engineer, but guess what? She is finishing this, becoming a sales director and on target to earn her first free car. I am so proud of you both. And that's just a few examples of the women in our, our glam unit that have just done huge things. And one of the things I wanted to share about this award is the highest increase. It's all about what I said before, is growth and change. So I wanna share what changed and how that growth came for me specifically. Number one is I knew that this was, Mary Durr's last year to become a national sales director. And for me, Mary has always been Mary Kay Ash because I never met her, but the way Mary treated me made me feel so important and so special. And I knew I could make a huge difference for this national area coming together. So her dream pushed me to follow my dreams. I saw her car drivers and at the time, there were only three premier level drivers and you need seven to finish a national area. The three drivers were Carmen Felix in the top 10, Tracy Chavez in the top 10, and Gina Beck in the top 10 of our national area, powerful women. And I thought, how can my name be next to theirs? And all I knew was I needed to do the work. And guess what? September 30th of 2019, we earned our first premier level car, the Chevy Equinox to be number four. And now if you look at our national National area that we just created the mountaintop achievers there are seven free car drivers at premier level and above and I'm so proud to say that we our glam unit really built that momentum and so Mary I just want to thank you publicly for living your dream for never giving up on becoming an NSC because of you I stretched my unit stretch and we now are on target to finish our first pink Cadillac September 30th, 2020. And if my son was here, he would tell you mama's pink car because that's all he talks about. And I'm so proud that we get to do that. And because of Mary's dream, that's what happened. So maybe your dream needs to be tied to someone else's success. Our next dreams are tied to us being having three offspring sales directors because that will help finish our summit national area as Carmen Felix steps in to be a national sales director. And I am just so proud to be a part of a huge legacy. 
And I wanna talk about the growth areas for me personally. Number one is my personal development growth. I took the time and effort and I got help for my mental. My mental health, I think it's important to take care of your mental health because what you think, what you believe, it's all about that. And we just got that training from Heidi Gelzer on limiting beliefs. And I really believe when you change your mind, you change the world. And so think about how you can help yourself. What can you do to get better in a mental health place for your mind to be there every morning, spending time with the Lord, getting help from other people, maybe getting help from professionals. You never know what's going to help you. And number two is my spiritual growth. And I will tell you, there is nothing sweeter to me than the time that I get to spend with the Lord to really know who I am in him. And a struggle for me for most of my career and really most of my life has been comparison. And I know people always say, don't compare, we're all so different. And it's really hard to, and I get that. But for me, I listened this year to what God had called for me. What are Robin Moore's strengths? What could the glam unit do? Not what this unit did, not what that unit did. And I always say, don't look to the left, don't look to the right, but look up. What does God have for you? And I'm so proud that this is what God has in store for us because this is really just feels like just the beginning for us. And so I want to ask you, are you honoring the three things that Mary Kay said to God first, family second, and career third? Are you honoring that time with God? Sometimes I know we wake up and like, I don't have time, but we don't have time not to. We have to spend that time with God. You have to honor the time with your family. I have a small two-year-old little boy. I have two bonus teenagers and an amazing husband who's behind the camera right now that I love so much. And I really honored this year the time with my family because family time is the most important. I honored my time with God because that was most important. And I honored the time in my career. When I had time to work, I did because I knew that it was important. So make sure you guys honor those times, honor the people in your life, honor them. And the last thing I wanna share with you is I've heard this quote a million times. And it says, you can do great things, but you cannot do everything. And I believe as women, and especially as mothers, that we try to be everything for everyone. We try to do everything we can for others. And I want you to remember that if you can't take care of yourself, if you don't take time for the things that you need, and really, if you don't take time to know and to learn and be willing to try new things, you will not be able to go where you wanna go. It's just a fact. And so don't think that those Women that you're seeing today are more successful than you because they did it all or why they did it all. Focus on what makes you successful and remember what things can you do in your gifts and strengths and really let the other things go. I always say Robin Moore likes to do things that bring her joy and make her money. The rest can be delegated and given away. And I just wanna lastly thank not only my family and my friends for all the support because I have the most supportive family and the most supportive parents, husband on the planet. I can't even explain how grateful I am, but for my Mary Kay sisters who supported me through this, who pushed me to be bigger and better because they live out loud, because playing small doesn't do good for anyone. They play big, it makes me play bigger. And I can't wait to see who's on this stage on Seminar 21, 2021 celebrating you and your highest increase thank you everyone i'm so proud